double amputee from Kansas who fought in the Iraq war is now fighting a battle to keep his home. Homes for Truths built this special house for Ryan Newell several years ago because of his disability. Cake's Deb Ferris now here with exclusive sound from Newell who will once law changed as he fights to keep his house through his divorce. Deb? Well, Chris, Ryan Newell is going through a divorce through the Marion County Court where a judge is considering taking away that house specially built for Newell. I don't deserve something like this just for going overseas, you know, and fighting. You know, it's just overwhelming. That was in 2010 when Homes for Troops built this handicap accessible home for veteran Ryan Newell. Now Newell is fighting to keep his house. It was built for the veteran, and the Homes for Our Troops specifically states that it's built for the veteran and for the needs of the veteran as well. Newell and his wife are going through a divorce. A Marion County judge ordered Newell out of the home in January, but another judge overturned that ruling. Now, just a couple of weeks ago, Newell's wife filed this motion asking for the house back. The struggles is getting the wheelchair around, not being, I mean, having to be able to get into the restroom or to shower and whatnot, it requires me to be able to have to crawl on my hands. And that's not Newell's only battle. He says he's trying to get Kansas law changed to protect veterans' disability pensions from being counted as income in divorce cases, money he says he needs to help take care of his daughter when she's with him. It may not help in my situation right now, but as long as I can help others, bring light and help them so they don't get put in the same situation later on down the road, then it's a win-win for everybody. I talked to Mrs. Newell's attorney today. He told me he simply cannot comment in this case because it's still pending. In Nevada, the lawmakers are working on a bill that would bar veterans' disability pay from being used in a divorce. Other states have also adopted similar laws.